Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Alhamdulillah, alhamdulillahirabbil alamin wassalatu wassalamu ala asrofil anbiya'i wal mursalin wa ala alihi washabbihi rasulillah ya jamain. The honorable examiner of this proposal seminar, Mr. Nuardi MED, and then the honorable uh, Dr. Dodi Setiawan MPD. And then on this special occasion, I'm Audia Zarasmara, student of English Education Department, Faculty of Teacher Training, uh, University of Sultan Sharif Qasim Riau. First of all, uh, I would like to thank the examiner who have given me the opportunity to present my research proposal with the title EFL University Student Satisfaction in Learning Writing, a case study at English Education Department of an Islamic University in Pekanbaru with the supervisor Dr. Bukhari SPDI MPD. Okay, my research proposal consists of three chapters. The first chapter is the introduction, and then the second chapter, literature review, and then the last chapter, methodology of the research. First, I will present to you the first chapter is the introduction. We can play from the background of the study. So, we must know how the importance of this research. So, the importance of the research is the importance of the learning writing. Learning writing is learning that includes two set of skill, namely writing skill using the writing process, consists pre-writing, planning, composing, and revising, and transcription skill consists of punctuation, capitalization, spelling, and handwriting. So, the definition show that the learning writing is very important is it's not an easy which can be done instantly, but learning writing must be done in structured manner which includes uh, pre pre writing skill and transcription skill. So, not only learning writing, student satisfaction in learning writing also is very important. Why? Because writing skill is considered a productive skill in learning. Because uh, with the learning skill, the student will be easy to make their scientific work, like consists of paper, uh, article, and etc. And then can effect in their satisfaction. Student satisfaction in learning is very important is language development, especially in learning writing. Uh, if the students are happy and satisfied with their learning, they will be participate in class and can encourage achievement in learning. So we continue to the next slide. So, the above fact emphasizes that student satisfaction with the learning classes, especially in learning writing, uh, is crucial to be investigated. However, there is uh, still lack of the research just focused on exploring uh, in depth student satisfaction in speaking, like Asad Yada 2022, Andriani 2020, Kutub 2018, Leong Ahmadi 2017, Asakere 2015. So, not only uh, previous study focused to exploring student satisfaction in speaking classes. Many previous study focused to online online lear, online classes, like Abdul Rahdi Akram 2022, Al Ghazaro Mustafa 2021, Han 2021, Rostamini 2021, Ponto Nuraili 2022, Ruth uh, Gorospe 2022, Cindy Sanora 2022. Gavi 2018, Wu 2000, and then Nesera. And then we can see that many previous study uh, discuss about uh, student satisfaction in speaking and uh, learning classes. But most uh, of previous study uh, in lack just focused to in learning writing. But uh, student satisfaction in writing discussed by Sarul Asari 2022, Lain Raya 2000. 20, Eliwarti Truwati Purwati 2019, Ibrahim Abbas 2018, Fernandez 2018. So, uh, after that, you can, we can say, uh, af after we can, we, we have the problem, we can identify, we can identify the problem. You can see in previous study and uh, after the research, a uh, uh, make observation or preliminary of the research. First, we can identify first uh, in previous study. In previous study, in learning writing, not been studied by many researchers, and most of previous study focus on three aspects. However, according to uh, Asakere, there are conceptually student satisfaction in learning writing can measure from six aspects. And 
uh, in we can identify the problem from the observation result after the researcher have a preliminary uh, or I mean after the researcher have observation uh, on February 2023 uh, the researcher found that the students still the lack of meeting uh, make them still unsatisfactory with their writing class a result student face problem in their learning especially in learning writing uh, some students said that uh, their their oven copy paste and pay, copy and pasting other people writing difficulty writing grammar and mechanic and many other things and also this is difficult and hard from the students if the student not understand about it so we can see uh, there are many problems uh, in previous study and hubs after the researcher have uh, observation we can conclude that if the student unsatisfactory with their learning especially in learning writing the impact will be later will be affect in their uh, in their writing or, or scientific, scientific paper and etc Okay, I, uh, after we identify, we can the limit uh, limitation of the problem. After uh, we know problem, we can mention above, which indicate this phenomenon. This researcher want to explore about more about explore. The researcher want to explore in the more about student satisfaction with learning writing, which. Uh, will be seen from the sick aspect including lecture, uh, course book, uh, linguistic, material, social, and facilities. And then the focus in this study is on student satisfaction in learning writing. So after uh, we limitation uh, the problem, we can make a formulation of the problem. So the formulation of the research is number one, how can student satisfaction in learning writing be described? And then number two, why do they have satisfaction as explained above? So, objective and significant of the research. I think this research not only uh, can can use from the theoretically but practically. From theoretically, the final of the research can be contribute to the development of knowledge or theory concept about satisfaction in learning writing. But practically. Uh, for the lecture, the result of the of this of the study are to provide new knowledge and as a reference well uh, of teaching method to teach more effectively, which is appropriate for the students in learning writing. So not only for the lecture, uh, it also uh, used from the students. Uh, for the student, this research can provide information about student satisfaction in learning writing, which provide provide a reference for the lecturer to find out which learning is effectively used in writing classes so the students are uh, motivated and can participate and active in class. So, uh, for major, this research can provide a reference for the study program so the study program can provide update related to things that support, I mean like the support from the student in learning process, for example, in class and etc. And then the last for the faculty, this research can provide a reference for faculty in order can provide update related to facilities in the class, for example, <coughs> in class, I mean like that. Continue to the next slide is chapter 2, literature review. So in this, in this research, uh, you can uh, you can see there are two the theory that relate the first is student satisfaction and learning writing the first is student satisfaction student satisfaction it means a student's perception when uh, students have educational experience and their hope were similar to what is uh, expected and in line with that, in learning writing, learning writing is learning that includes uh, two set of skill, namely writing skill using the writing process, consists of pre-writing, planning, composing, and revising, and transcription skill consists of punctuation, capitalization, spelling, and etc. Okay, uh, it is slight still uh, about related theories. Uh, the concept of the research adapted from the 
Asakere, 2015. This is concept. Uh, there are six aspect from the student satisfaction in learning rating, including lectures, course book, linguistic material, social, and facilities. Okay, we continue to the next slide in conceptual framework. So, in this research, many researchers, many experts, uh, adapted for many experts, Expert, I mean, uh, for example, uh, you can see Asakere, Eliwati, Rahmawati, Sedita. From the Asakere, there are six aspects uh, can uh, student satisfaction in learning writing. First is uh, lectures, course book, linguistic, material, social, and facility. So, in aspect from the lectures, we can measure three, three aspects. Uh, component. The first is ability from the lectures, motivation from the lectures, attitude and attitude from the lectures. So, uh, the aspect uh, number two, course book. Uh, there are we can measure from the two aspect, including material and information. And then linguistic, we can measure from the two component, uh, like uh, language and cognitive. And then number four, material, uh, we can measure from the one aspect uh, like syllabi and then uh, number five aspect uh, aspect from the theory asakere social we can measure from the three component the first is communication participation and intelligence and then the last aspect facilitas uh, we can measure from the uh, what did this, what is that one two three four five five aspect the first is tangible reliability responsiveness assurance and empathy and then in line with that uh, from the theory of Hamawati ad, ad, I adapted from the theory of Rahmawati uh, there are aspect from the student satisfaction in learning writing first is curriculum material course book and then campus first service and the last professional of the research and then you can see this is uh, the process from the uh, learning writing first is uh, according to Sedita pre writing, planning, composing, and revising. And then we can identify if the student have uh, experience and they are they are uh, one related to their expected. For example, uh, process uh, the process of learning writing. Writing first is pre writing. Pre writing uh, we can measure from the aspect lectures. In component ability, for example, and then process planning, uh, in component course book, and then etc. Okay, we continue to the next slide. Chapter 3, Research Methodology. Uh, this is research process and design. This session will use in qualitative research with a case study research design because this research will describe and explore in detail and holistically how the student satisfaction in learning writing. Specifically, for design, we'll use case study because research will the explore of indiv one individual on one group uh, based on the phenomenon. From, uh, I forget to take uh, according from Creswell. Uh, in general, case study referred to in deep examination of a particular individual group, organization, or phenomenon. It involves uh, collecting the detailed information and analyzing various aspects of the case. I think this is uh, this is a purpose. The purpose of this research, uh, a case study, I mean. Uh, in line or ways in this uh, definition from the case study. Continue to the time and location and research. So, inshallah, this research will be conducted at Islamic University in Pekanbaru, and then this research is planned to be carried out in September or October 2023. And then this location will be chosen because it will be easy to researchers to conduct research that what support after the research met of observation and preliminary of the research I mean like uh, observation lah, and then uh, on. February 2023 and then have a problem at Islamic University in Pekanbaru so we continue to the next slide so the participant in this research will be third semester students at Islamic University in Pekanbaru where we're taking a writing course 
participant will be used the total number of the of students at one class is 33 people consists of 5 men and 28 females by using homogeneous sampling types of proposing sampling has a technique so technique of data collection in this research using questionnaire and interview the first is questionnaire in this research a questionnaire will be used uh, as uh, the first technique to find out general picture of student satisfaction in learning writing uh, according to uh, Sultan Darnia 2000, uh, 2002 questionnaire, questionnaire uh, used to uh, find out general picture of student satisfaction in learning writing if uh, researchers have uh, in deep understanding about uh, the research and then interview in this research the interview will be used as a second technique to explain student satisfaction in learning writing so this is a, a blueprint student satisfaction in learning writing uh, from the questionnaire the first is there are six dimensions the first is the satisfaction with lecture satisfaction with course book satisfaction with linguistic satisfaction with material satisfaction with social and then satisfaction in facilities and then indicator in this uh in this lectures first is feeling satisfied and need fulfilled by the lectures in form ability motivation and attitude and then satisfaction in course book uh, uh, the feeling satisfaction uh, from the component information and then for the linguistic uh, feeling satisfaction for the component of language and cognitive and then from the material feeling satisfaction uh, with component of syllabi and then satisfaction with social feeling satisfied uh, with a uh, with component communication participation in intelligent between lectures and then satisfaction with speech facilities uh, can feeling satisfied with a uh, component uh, first is tangible reality responsiveness assurance and empathy so uh, in the uh, in the first lectures uh, no item is three and then the course book item is two uh, linguistic item 2 satisfaction is item 1 satisfaction which uh, social uh, the, the total number item is 3 satisfaction fac facilitas uh, the total number is 5 and then we continue to the next slide uh, this is blueprint student satisfaction in learning writing for the interview this is uh, is the same from the questionnaire a uh, still uh, category from the six aspect and then focus area uh, from the the same from the questionnaire but focus uh, focus and in deep exploring student satisfaction in learning writing uh, from the six aspect and then focus area uh, ability motivation attitude information in from the from the course book from the information and then etc so technique of data analysis in this research the researcher used two types of technique is collecting the data uh, namely questionnaire and interview the first the data from questionnaire will be analyzed by using descriptive statistic consists of mean and percentage descriptive statistic is the process of collecting organizing concluding and briefing presentation data to provide better and easy understand for the data user sultan dorney 2002 the purpose of descriptive statistics as a technique is to provide of overview of the characteristics. I mean, the purpose of this uh, using descriptive tech in the research as a technique to provide overview of the characteristics of the observed data and to find out general picture of student satisfaction in learning writing. So, this is a Laker scale of questionnaire. Uh, there are categories. Uh, there are five categories. Uh, description of Laker scale. The first is very satisfactory, 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 neutral, unsatisfactory, and very satisfactory. So technique of uh, analysis from interview for interview, and for interview the data will be analyzed by using inductive analysis based on theory of Miles, two thousand fourteen, which said that in inductive analysis is qualitative research approaches that involves the development of theories and pattern of understanding based on the data collected. Miles, two 
2014 and Huberman 1992, which state that there are three processes of qualitative analysis, the first data reduction, data display, and data and conclusion or verification. And we continue to the next slide, transportiness. Validity checking is crucial aspect of research as it helps establish the credibility and reliability of the collected data. In qualitative method, there are uh, several uh, procedures available to ensure data validity, including uh, member checking, uh, triangulation, and then uh, auditing. In this research, to validate to validate the data will be used triangulation. Triangulation involves the use of multi multiple data sources method or researcher to uh, cross uh, verify and corroborate the finding. Uh, the be and changing the trustworthiness and validity of the collecting the data. Creswell 2000, according to Creswell. Okay, I think that's all my uh, my presentation. Uh, sorry, my witnesses. Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.